Well, they are the unsung heroes of the Himalayan nightmare. Brave soldiers working tirelessly around the clock to rescue the lives of their fellow human beings with scant regard for their own well-being. A sharp contrast to our politicians who, in the comfort of their armchairs, indulge in cliched lip service and blame games. The worst tragedy to strike the Himalayan state, the devastation is unprecedented. And as survivors battle against time and nature, India launches its biggest rescue operation ever. And again, it's the Indian Army which is in the vanguard. The men in fatigues leading from the front on a war footing, risking their lives to rescue the trapped survivors, battling the devastation all around. After a suspension of almost an hour, the Indian Air Force helicopters are back as you're seeing out there, an MI-17 B-5 is taking to the skies. According to the Indian Air Force, Operation Rahat has been restarted with full vigor. Not only will they be doing what they've been doing for the last 48 hours, which is airdropping supplies and evacuating men, but today they've also got the Army's Para Brigade and the Army Supply Corps troops who are in this area, as you see in the area behind me, who are ready and they're waiting to be airdropped into the affected areas with Kedarnath being their prime target. With camera person Vakar Ahmed in Dehradun, this is Jugal Purohit reporting for Headlines Today. This is just one amongst the countless acts of valor and selflessness by the armed forces. With hundreds of people stranded after a landslide in this remote corner of Uttarakhand, a group of army jawans toiled to cut a small dangerous path. Locals were nervous about treading the tiny path because of the sheer drop of hundreds of feet down to the raging river. Batting not an eyelid, the army jawans formed a human safety band featuring on the edge of the path, placing their own lives in danger so that those they had rescued could cross the mountain. Our goal is that every 1-2 km in the middle of the middle of the road, our Senec land routes and air routes from the air to the air so that those people can be able to save them with each other. Contrast the selflessness with the armchair concern of our natives. They prefer to remain untouched by the agony, taking a bird's eye view of the mayhem, while the Jawans battle the ravages, the ruins and the plunder of nature. Bureau Report, Headlines Today.